Dave was an all-around, kind of like a superhero for the Colorado community. Dave Henderson was an innocent witness who was shot 10 times, killed for simply doing the right thing. And when he contacted law enforcement to tell them what he knew, I don't think he realized at that time that he would be putting himself in harm's way. David Henderson was a witness in a case of a robbery at this pot shop in August of 2016. He was killed two months later by Tina and Terrence Black. They definitely made some threats. They initially came to him. Uh, there was a gun put in his face. He was threatened if he continued to cooperate that it would result in the loss of his life. That had a profound effect on him, but not so profound that it overwhelmed his sense of duty and righteousness and he moved forward and he died as a result. Prosecutors say the court mistakenly sent out unredacted arrest affidavits to people involved in the case, and that's how the blacks found out Henderson was cooperating with police about their involvement in the robbery. In some ways, this was a perfect storm of different events that took place. You know, there were a number of affidavits on a number of cases that were sent out, but they were sent out to people who would never dream of trying to murder the witnesses against them. It just happened to reach the group that was willing to do it in this case. Prosecutors asked for the maximum penalty, saying it is unacceptable to assassinate a witness. David Henderson's family members say even they felt intimidated at times just being present at the trial, but they say it was important for them to be here. It's important that I go public and talk about it because I don't. I want people to know that they can't get away with this. Um, you should never threaten a witness and you should never murder a witness.